Hi, my name is Rebecca Dar, and I have the great honor of serving as the president and CEO of Wings. I'm honored to tell you also that we just learned from Charity Navigator that for the fifth year in a row, uh, Wings is receiving the highest ranking, a four-star ranking. And this accomplishment does not go unnoticed. It's important that agencies do the hard work and, and get results with their clients and, and have fiscal uh, stewardship of their funds and WINGS does that. We are currently ending our, our another fiscal year at WINGS and many of you gave contributions throughout the year and we cannot thank you enough for those contributions. We are so grateful and proud of this accomplishment um, as we approach this fiscal end of this fiscal year. And we want you to know that your investments are making an impact that is resulting in that rating. Recently, we told you the story of Julianne. Julianne was a child when she came to Wings with her family. She was withdrawn, afraid. She had been through some really horrible situations and she had a lot to overcome. But with safe housing and the counseling that she was provided, she came out of that shell. And Julianne went on to overcome mental health challenges, to go to college, and then ultimately to get her master's degree in social work so that she could help other children in the way that she had been helped. Julianne did her internship at Wings. A person who was a child who got help from Wings came back to give help to other children at Wings. She is a true testament to a success story and the impact that your donations have when you get to Wings. As we approach the end of our fiscal year, I hope that you can help us end on a strong note and provide more support so that we can make those investments in more children, just like Julianne. You saw the impact in her life and you can make the impact in another child's life. It is a return on these investments that make Wings a four-star charity. Thank you so much for your support and have a very wonderful day. Thank you.